İngiliz dilinden sözleşiyor dersleri. Başlangıç derece. Assalamu alaikum barçıgı. Benim ismim Müşteri Boymatva. Ve sizler bilen Brad Parzantlar'ın da hukası da 77. dersi koşturduğumdan cüdayım kursamın. Bugünki dersimizin mevzusu Sharing Personal Success Stories. Yani şahsi muvaffaqiyat hikayelerini baham koruştuğum konu İngiliz dilinden aynen ufkanamız. Kanda yakılıp uf, bu mevzuda İngiliz dilinde suhbat koruş mümkün. Bunu bugünki dersi korasız. So, sit comfortably and let's start. Hey, how? Hey, how's it going? I heard you did something amazing recently. Salam, işleringiz kanday kiti yaptı. Yakında acayip bir iş kılgeningiz hakkında işittim. Yana bir martı. Hey, how's it going? I heard you did something amazing recently. Oh, hi. Yeah, it's been quite a journey. I finally finished writing my first book. Oh, salam. Ha, bu juda uzoq sayohat bo'ldi. Nihoyat birinchi kitobimni yozib tugatdim. I finally finished writing. Ya'ni yozib tugatdim. My first book. Birinchi kitobimni. It's been a quite journey. Bu juda uzoq sayohat bo'ldi. Quite a journey. Ya'ni bir uzoq sayohat bo'ldi degan ma'noni beradi. Wow, that's fantastic. I didn't know you were into writing. What's the book about? Wow, that's fantastic. Why, bu ajayib. I didn't know you were into writing. To be fiyle va into bilan keyin biror bir otni ishlatsak yoki fiyilni ayinji qo'shgan holda ishlatsak, o'sha biror bir sohaga qiziqish ma'nosini beradi. Misol uchun, I'm into writing, men yozishga qiziqaman. I'm into yoki otni oladigan bo'lsak, mathematics, men matematikaga qiziqaman. She's into swimming, u suzishga qiziqadi. Demak, bu yerda I didn't know, men bilmas edim, you were into writing, siz um, yozishga qiziqishingizni. What's the book about? Kitob nima haqida? It's a story about overcoming challenges and finding courage. I wanted to share my personal experiences to inspire others. It's a story, yani, hikoya about overcoming challenges, qiyinchiliklarni yengish, and finding courage va jasoratli bo'lish haq va jasoratli bo'lish haqida. Bu yerda find courage albatta jasorat topish degan ma'noni berishi, biz jasoratli bo'lish deya o'zbek tilida aytamiz. I wanted to share my personal experiences. Yani men nima uchun to inspire others. Yani to inspire others ni boshida aytamiz. Boshqalarni ilhomlantirish uchun shaxsiy tajribamni baham ko'rishni istadim. I wanted to share my personal experiences. That sounds interesting. How did you come up with the idea? Qiziq, qanday qilib siz bu fikrga keldingiz? Come up with the idea, yani fikrge kelmok. I came up with a good idea. Minge yaxshi bir fikr keldi. Bu yerda esa qanday qilib o'sha fikrge keldingiz degan savol. How did you come up with the idea? Well, I faced some tough times in a, a few years ago and writing became a way for me to express myself. As I started sharing my story, friends encouraged me to turn it into a book. Well, I faced some tough times a few years ago, and writing became a way for me to express myself. As I started sharing my story, friends encouraged me to turn it into a book. Va uchinchi marta o'qiyman, men bilan birga qaytarishni unutmang. Well, I faced some tough times a few years ago, and writing became a way for me to express myself. As I started sharing my story, friends encouraged me to turn it into a book. Demak, face feeling, o'tgan darslarda tushuntirib o'tgan edim, duch kelish, qarama-qarshi bo'lish, yuz ya'ni yuzlashish degan ma'noni beradi biror bir narsa bilan. Bu yerda albatta Some years, a few years ago, bir necha yil oldin men qiyin paytlarga duch keldim. I faced some tough times, tough times qiyin paytlar. And writing became a way for me to express myself. Va yozish men uchun o'z fikrlarimni ifodalash usuliga aylandi. Became a way, ya'ni usuliga aylandi for me to express myself. O'zimni, ya'ni ifodalash uchun. 
as I started sharing my story, xqoyamni baham ko'rishni boshlaganimda, boshlaganimda as I started as, ya'ni o'sha boshlaganimda, my friends encouraged me to turn it into a book. Ya'ni do'stlarim meni uni kitobga aylantirishga undadi. Encourage, ya'ni ruhlantirish, motivatsiya berish undamoq. That's really cool. I've been thinking about starting a project too, but I am not sure where to begin. Bu juda zo'r. That's really cool. I've been thinking about bu present perfect continuous zamoni. Albatta grammatika darslarida buni ko'ring, juda ham foydali zamon. I've been thinking about, ya'ni o'tgan zamonda boshlab, haligacha davom etib kelayotgan bo'lsa, biror bir harakat chunki holat haligacha davom etib kelayotgan bo'lsa, unda siz present perfect ishlatishingiz kerak. Agar harakat o'tgan zamonda boshlanib, nomuayyan davom etgan bo'lib va bilmaydigan biz bilmaydigan vaqtda tugagan bo'lsa, present perfect ishlatamiz unda ham. Lekin agar yana bir marta qaytarib o'taman, harakat o'tgan zamonda boshlanib, hozirgacha davom etib kelayotgan bo'lsa va oxirgi yetmagan bo'lsa, hali hamon present perfect continuous zamonini ishlatamiz. Demak, hali hamon bu inson o'ylab kelyapti. I've been thinking about Starting a project too. Nima haqida? Ya'ni bir loyiha boshlash haqida. But I'm not sure where to begin. Lekin qayerdan boshlashga ishonchim komil emas. Trust me. I felt the same way at first. Ishoning, avvaliga men ham xuddi shunday his qildim. I felt the same way at first. The key is to take small steps and stay committed. Yani, uh, asosisi, the key as the key the key, bu yerda asosisi. Asosisi, kichik qadamlar qoyish, take small steps, take, take all ishoz aslida, lekin take small steps, kichik qadamlar qoyish. And stay committed, va ishingizge sadiq qolish. You'll be surprised at what you can achieve. Siz nimaga erishingiz mumkinligidan hayratda qolasiz. Kelajak zamon you will be you will be surprised hayratda qolasiz at what you can achieve nimadan nimalarni erishingiz mumkinligidan Thanks for the advice It's just inspiring to hear about your success What was the most challenging part for you Thanks for the advice maslahat uchun rahmat It's just inspiring to hear about your success. Ya'ni sizning muvaffaqiyatingiz haqida eshitish shuncha shuncha ilhomlantiradi. What was the most challenging part for you? The most, ya'ni superlative zamon, superlative ko'rinishi sifatining. Siz siz uchun eng qiyin qism nima edi? Definitely staying focused and believing in myself. There were times when I doubted if anyone would be interested in my story. But with perseverance, I managed to push through. They might definitely staying focused and believing in myself. Bu yerda bizda eng qiyin qism qaysi bo'ldi degan savolga biz albatta diqqatni jamlab, o'zimga ishonish deya javob berdik. Staying focused and believing in myself. Bu yerda fe'llar ayinchi ko'rinishni olganligining sababi nima degan savolga biz ot bilan javob berishimiz kerak. Shuning uchun fe'ldan ot yasashga urgan holda biz ayinchi qo'shimchasini qo'shganmiz. There were times when I doubted if anyone would be interested in my story. Shunaqangi paytlar bo'ldiki, demak, I doubted, ya'ni men shubha qilardim kimdir meni o'sha hikoyamga qiziqarmikin degan holda kimdir meni hikoyamga qiziqadimi deb shubha qilgan paytlarim bo'lgan deya yozilgan mana but with perseverance ammo sabr toqat bilan i managed to push through bu qiyinchiliklardan o'tishga muvaffaq bo'ldim i managed to push through push through ya'ni o'tishga manage to muvaffaq bo'lmoq i can imagine that wasn't easy It's motivating to know that doubts can be overcome. I might give my idea a shot after all. I can imagine that wasn't easy. Tasavvur qila olamanki, bu oson bo'lmagan. It's motivating to know that doubts can be overcome. Ya'ni shubhalarni yengib o'tish mumkinligini bilish rag'batlantiradi. It's motivating. Nima qilish? Ya'ni to know that doubts can be overcome. To know bilish Doubts, ya'ni shubhalar, 
overcome, yengib otish mumkinligini, ya'ni shu shubhalarni yengib otish mumkinligini. I might give my idea shot after all. Oxir oqibatda balki men ham o'z g'oyamni sinab ko'rarman degan demak tajribani ko'rishimiz mumkin bu yerda. Absolutely. Don't let your doubts hold you back. If I can do it, so can you. And who knows? Maybe we'll be celebrating your success story next. Albatta, shubhalar sizni ushlab turishiga yo'l qo'ymang. Men qila oldimmi, demak siz ham qila olasiz va kim biladi, balki keyingi safar sizning muvaffaqiyatingizni tarixini nishonlaydigan bo'larmiz. Demak, bu yerda qarang. Don't let your doubts hold you back. Don't let doubts hold you back. Shubhalar sizni orqaga tortishiga imkon bermang. Let bu imkon berish hold you back orqaga tortishiga. If I can do it, agar men qila olsam, so can you. Siz ham qila olasiz. Siz ham qila olasizni qisqartirib biz shunchaki so va fe'lni oldinga chiqaramiz. Can you? So can you. Siz ham. And who knows va kim biladi? Maybe, balki will be celebrating. Biz tabriklayotgan, nishonlayotgan bo'lamiz. Your success story next. Sizning muvaffaqiyatingizning tarixini keyingi safar. Demak, ushbu suhbatda biz a bir insonning muvaffaqiyat tarixini tingladik, eshitdik va ikkinchi inson bunga albatta reaksiyalar bildirdi va birinchi inson motivatsiya berdi ham. Siz ham ushbu gaplardan iboralardan foydalangan holda shunday mavzularga suhbat qurishingiz mumkin va yana bir maslahatim, darsni yana bir marta tomosha qilgan holda men demak bu yerda ikki kishi A va B o'rtasida bo'lgan suhbatni A ni men o'qiganimda siz B ni va aksincha keyingi safar men B ni o'qiganimda siz A ni shunday qilib o'rnini almashtirgan holda practice qilsangiz bu juda ham yordam beradi so try it see you in the next lessons bye bye